by Morgan Phillips, Congress reporter for Daily Mail, com and Kelly Locko, executive editor of politics for Daily Mail, com. A top Republican was warned there is a serious national security threat in a cryptic statement demanding President Joe Biden declassify all related information. House Intel Chair Rep. Mike Turner of Ohio said members of Congress had been made aware of the threat, but wouldn't go into details. He asked the president to declassify the information in the ominous warning so lawmakers could discuss the ramifications. The threat is highly concerning and destabilizing, and related to Russia, CNN reported as Capitol Hill scrambled for more details. Members of Congress or U.S. allies will not be allowed to openly talk about or work together on the threat until the report has been declassified. Today, the House Permanent Select Committee on Intelligence has made available to all members of Congress information concerning a serious national security threat, he said. I am requesting that President Biden declassify all information relating to this threat so that Congress, the administration, and our allies can openly discuss the actions necessary to respond to. This threat, National Security Advisor Jake Sullivan said Wednesday he was surprised Turner came publicly about the threat related to a destabilizing foreign military capability. He told reporters at the White House the briefing on the warning will take place in Congress on Thursday. I reached out earlier this week to the Gang of Eight to offer myself up for a personal briefing to the Gang of Eight and, in fact, we scheduled a briefing for the four House members of the Gang of Eight tomorrow. Sullivan told the White House media briefing. That's been on the books. So I am a bit surprised that Congressman Turner came out publicly today in advance of a meeting on the books for me to go sit with him alongside our intelligence and defense professionals tomorrow. I'm not in a position to say anything else, he added. Representative Jim Hines, the ranking Democrat on the Intel Committee, insisted there was no need to panic, but also wouldn't go into details. It's something that the Congress and the administration does need to address in the medium to long run. The ominous warning comes as the House is expected to move on a bill to reauthorize the FBI's controversial spy tool. Section 702 of the Foreign Information Surveillance Act, FISA. The tool allows U.S. federal intelligence agencies to conduct targeted searches of foreigners, which they say is critical to stopping terrorists. Lawmakers are determined to fix rampant abuses. To the program before reauthorizing the bill, so that the FBI does not improperly conduct queries of Americans in the process of stopping threats. Turner is leading the charge on a bill that the House could vote on as soon as Thursday. He is adamant that the legislation contains no warrant requirements he says could hinder national security. Bill text was released earlier in the week, which joins together the competing bills that passed last year out of the House Intel and Judiciary Committees. But some members of the GOP have pushed back on the combined version, saying more reforms are necessary and there should be a warrant requirement. Current law allows the U.S. government to collect data on you, House Freedom Caucus Chair Bob Good said Tuesday. But Turner has been critical of requiring warrants, which he says will overly burden the intelligence community. We do not and should not need a warrant to look at legally and constitutionally collected data from terrorists. Turner previously told DailyMail.com. Read the full story. https colon slash slash www.dailymail.co.uk slash news slash article dash 130838777 slash Mike dash Turner dash warns dash Biden dash national dash security dash threat dash declassify dash information dot html question mark ito equals MSN gallery. Want more stories like this from the Daily Mail? Visit our profile page and hit the follow button above for more of the news you need.